What's going on, folks? This is Bribe, and I'm just doing a quick video here um, because I know there's a lot of people that I know, um, and probably that you also know, that don't really know how to jungle properly. Um, so I'm gonna pick a free champion this week who's actually very simple to jungle with, and I'm just gonna show you what it's like. And this is not an optimized path, this is not like the best way to do things. I'm just showing you how to get to level 4 safely and easily so that you can try it out yourself and uh, yeah, just have a good time jungling because it's so easy. Um, the only stressful thing about it is if like multiple lanes need a gank at the same time. But uh, if you're playing a champion like Nunu, because he is free this week, he's so easy to jungle with. His ganks are so simple, his build is so cheap. Um, but yeah, you won't regret trying them out. So uh, what we're going to do is we're going to run here to Wolves first, which is right here on the map, if you look, right here, right next to uh, the mid tower here. This is a custom game, so there's not going to be any counter jungling or anything like that. This is just going to be like a standard path that you would take, like the most basic of basic paths to take. Um, I'm actually using a tank mastery page right now. If you look at my summoner profile, it's BR1V3. You can copy it, and I'm also using tank runes with uh, gold per five, or sorry, gold per ten uh, quintessences. All right, so the wolf spawn at 140. You just eat the big one. Keep smashing away on these little ones. I take a, a attack speed marks so I can clear just a little bit faster. Oh. Just to let you know, your blue buff spawns at 155, so I was a little late getting there. Usually you like to be able to clear the wolves by then. And this is why Nunu is so good as a jungler. You eat him, you get a bunch of health back. You attack him a few times, and he's dead. I highly recommend taking Blood Boil second, not only so you can move faster, but you get an attack speed bonus as well. You don't really need to level up Consume at all. Uh, consume is just like, uh, you know, it's like an extra smite. Um, it's, it's really good. Um, buff control, it's really good like uh, objective control on dragon and such if you're taking it, especially if you couple it with um, with smite because at level 1 it's 500 true damage and um, that's very very powerful. As you can see like Nunu clears the jungle incredibly fast. I'm just going to eat this for health. And as you notice I started with boots and potions so I get to move faster as well um, and with the tank masteries you gain extra speed. But with uh, Nunu's Blood Boil, you also get increased movement speed and attack speed. So it's just it's just win all around. Um, I'm actually going to level up Blood Boil second, again. If you didn't know this, you can actually level your skills by holding control, unless you rebound it, um, and pressing the skill that you actually want to level up. So if, when I'm leveling up skills, I'm holding control and pressing either control Q, control W, control E, or control R. Move over to red buff here. Give myself blood oil. Consume here just to get a little bit of HP. You can level up consume maybe one or two levels if you want, um, because it will give you extra health when you consume stuff. But with blue buff, um, especially in the early game, is when you're really gonna need it the most. Um, it really doesn't matter because the cooldown is so low. As you can see, I'm at like almost full HP. I'm gonna hit level four here very shortly. Uh, don't forget that your red buff actually does true damage over time to your, to your when you on your attacks. So when you hit level four, take your slow, and you can either gank mid or you can go bottom. Uh, this since I'm on the bottom part portion of the map right now, um, those are the two easiest lanes to gank as soon as you hit level four. And uh, yeah, that's it. Enjoy.